Okay. Please sit with your back straight, feet on the ground. If you can't hear me or there is any interference, please let me know now. Otherwise, um, uh, as you have feet on the ground, hands on your upper thighs facing up. Um, gently focus on your third eye, which is above the bridge of your nose between your eyebrow. We're gonna start with karaoke yoga breathing to clean our Kundalini line from week's activities. Uh, as you breathe in, uh, visualize if you can, as you inhale, air moving from your tailbone through your backbone all the way through back of your head and then entering your center of your head where your pineal gland or third eye is. As you exhale, do the same thing in the reverse side. So from your center of your head to the back of your head, all the way down through your vertebra to your tailbone. So let's do that a few times. And you can say hung or om as you inhale. You can say so, S-O-W, coming from throat like this, ah, so, um, if you wish, as you exhale. Um, and so let's go on with that a few times so we can get our um, Kundalini lines clean. As you can see, when you're doing this, you feel the vibration going up. So this is a great way of raising your vibration during the week or during the day, if you have some um, times that you would like to raise your frequency. Okay, now uh, we are going to uh, visualize a beautiful light, golden light from above our head from the sky. Uh, it's golden light with silver intertwined. Uh, it's weaved into it. It just enters our crown chakra, which is at the top of our head. As it enters, it cleans and energizes. It covers it full and completely. It cleans and energizes. It moves down to your third eye, to the center of your head, your third eye. It covers it in golden light fully and completely it goes down cleans and energizes it goes down to your throat chakra it clean it covers it fully and completely cleans and energizes it moves down to your heart chakra, which is at the center of your chest where your sternum is. Covers it in golden light fully and completely. It cleans and energizes. It moves down to your solar plex. It covers it fully and completely. It cleans and energizes. It goes down to your sacral chakra, which is two and a half inches below your navel. It covers it fully and completely. It cleans and energizes. It goes down to your basic chakra where your sex organs, your groin area is located. It covers it in golden light fully and completely. It cleans and energizes. And it's go down, it's golden light travels through your leg, it goes down, down, down through your leg, all the way down to Mother Earth. It travels further down to the core of Mother Earth. 
as we share this beautiful golden light from multiverse with Mother Earth, this healing and energizing energy. And it keeps expanding to the core of Mother Earth during our meditation. And we share this with our gratitude and thanks with Mother Earth. The bounty that is giving us every moment of our lives. We have gratitude. Part of this beautiful golden light travels through our leg. It goes up. It goes up, up travels through our rare chakra, Ming Meng, back solar plex, back heart chakra. As it goes through them, it cleans and energizes, and it goes travel through our crown chakra, and it goes up the multiverse. Now this beautiful golden light, we should have a tunnel of it, going through us from multiverse through our chakras all the way to Mother Earth. It expands and expands like a bubble to cover our first auric layer. So if you would like, you can visualize yourself as a lotus being at the center, first row of petals, or you can visualize an onion, you're at the center and the first layer, or as I do normally, and that is, I visualize a bubble that it covers the first auric layer in golden light fully and completely. Any and all blockages, anything less than law, dissipate, disintegrate. Now, take a deep breath. expanding this beautiful golden light to cover your sec second auric layer, your second auric layer. It is covered in golden light fully and completely. Any and all block, just anything less than love, dissipate and disintegrate. Now take a deep breath. Moving on to the third auric layer. Golden light expands to cover your third auric layer. Golden light fully and completely. Any and all blockages, anything less than love, dissipate and disintegrate. Now take a deep breath. Moving on to the fourth auric layer. The golden light expands to cover your fourth auric layer in golden light fully and completely. Any and all blockages, anything less than love, dissipate and disintegrate. Now take a deep breath. Golden light moves and expands to cover your fifth auric layer. Fifth auric layer is covered in golden light fully and completely. Any and all blockages, anything less than love, dissipate and disintegrate. Now take a deep breath. Moving on to the sixth auric layer, the golden light expands to cover your sixth auric layer in golden light fully and completely. Any and all blockages, anything less than love, dissipate and disintegrate. Now take a deep breath.
Moving on to the seventh auric layer, the golden light expands to cover your seventh auric layer in golden light fully and completely. Any and all blockages, anything less than love, precipitate and disintegrate. Now take a deep breath. Now we're going to move to templates. Each template corresponds to a chakra, starting with the first template corresponding with our basic chakra. Same principle, golden light is covering your first template, like a bubble, your first layer. It's covered in golden light fully and completely. Any and all blockages, anything less than love, dissipate and disintegrate. Now take a deep breath. Moving on to the second template corresponding to your sacral chakra. It is covered in golden light fully and completely. Any and all blockages, anything less than love, dissipate and disintegrate. Now take a deep breath. Moving on to the third template corresponding to your solar plex chakra. It is covered in golden light fully and completely. Any and all blockages, anything less than love, dissipate and disintegrate. Now take a deep breath. Moving on to our fourth template corresponding to our heart chakra. It is covered in golden light fully and completely. Any and all blockages, anything less than love, dissipate and disintegrate. Now take a deep breath. Moving on to our fifth template corresponding to our throat chakra. It is covered in golden light fully and completely. Any and all blockages, anything less than love, precipitate and disintegrate. Now take a deep breath. Moving on to the sixth template corresponding to our third eye, it is covered in golden light fully and completely. Any and all blockages, anything less than love, precipitate and disintegrate. Now take a deep breath. Moving on to the seventh template corresponding to our crown chakra. It is covered in golden light fully and completely. Any and all blockages, anything less than love, precipitate and disintegrate. Now take a deep breath. We are now going to disregard and dispense with our cords, energetic cords that doesn't serve us. You can visualize electrical plug with a cord attached to it, attached to your energetic bodies. And on the other side of it, same format electrical plug with a cord attached to other souls, whomever, wherever they are. Just visualize you're detaching these plugs from both sides with the cord attached. Any and all coercive links, any and all karmic links that no longer serves, any and all energetic links from us to others or others to us that doesn't serve and is less than love, precipitate and disintegrate. Now, take deep breath.
We're gonna start with opening our chakra, starting with basic chakra to raise our frequency to the seventh frequency. When we open a chakra, with basic chakra, it opens like a, like a funnel and the whiteness of it, the area that is open wide would be away from you. And with basic chakra, it is facing the ground when it opens up. How does it open? You extend it fully and rotating it clockwise. Rotation, if you have a clock, visualize that the handle moves from 12 to three to six to nine to 12. So starting with basic chakra, we are opening it fully, rotating it clockwise, or you can say, if you can't visualize, you can say, I'm opening my basic chakra fully, rotating it clockwise, or I'm opening my basic chakra now. Moving on to the sacral chakra, it opens in front of you. You extend it fully, rotating it clockwise, or you say, I'm extending my sacral chakra fully, rotating it clockwise, or I'm opening my sacral chakra now. Moving on to solar plex chakra, it opens in front of you, extend it fully, rotate it clockwise, or say, I'm extending my solar plex chakra fully, rotating it clockwise, or I'm opening my solar plex chakra now. Moving on to the heart chakra, which is the center of your chest, you extend it fully, rotate it clockwise, or you can say, I'm extended fully, and rotating it clockwise, or I'm opening my heart chakra now. Moving on to the throat chakra, it opens in front of you, it's at the center of your throat, it extends fully, rotating clockwise, or say, I'm extending fully, and rotating my, clock, my throat chakra, or I'm opening my throat chakra now. Moving on to your third eye chakra, it opens in front of you. You extend it fully, rotate it clockwise, or say, I'm extending my third eye chakra fully, rotating it clockwise, or I'm opening my third eye chakra now. Moving on to the crown chakra, it opens, with the wideness of the cone or funnel facing up against toward the sky. So you extend it fully, the same style of rotating it clockwise, or you can say, I'm extending my crown chakra fully and rotating it clockwise, or I'm opening my crown chakra now. Now, if you're sensitive, you're able to hear a lot of energy movement and you can feel your chakras and the energy and, the, and its vibrations and feel it. We're at the seventh frequency. At this time, we're gonna get rid of anything that may have attached to us. So since you're at the seventh frequency, you're a higher frequency than other astral entities or things that attach. So, you're going to say, I am at a high frequency and any and all astral entities at this level or below levels cannot stick to me any longer. And see that they all just slip away like you're a Teflon and everything just slip away uh, within your energetic bodies, your chakras, inside your chakra. It's just slip away from you. You can either Visualize a vacuum that is sucking it in or you're in a whirlwind and it just takes them all and it just takes them to multiverse. Tornado that comes in and it just takes them all. And again, you can repeat, I'm at a high frequency and any and all astral entities attached at this level or lower level cannot stick to me and just see that they all will slip away like you are a Teflon and they can stick to me. You feel a relief or you feel lightness, that's because you have shed them. Now that we are at the seventh frequency, 
We're gonna start our meditation wherever we are. We're gonna create a virtual circle by holding hands. Part of the small universe, beautiful energy. It's as it's going through our body, through our chakras, it sends healing and rejuvenating energy to Mother Earth. And it just goes and expands through the core of Mother Earth. Now, be expanding this beautiful, beautiful multiverse energy to cover the circle that we have created wherever we are. And also covering ourselves with it since we are. And sending this beautiful energy expanding it, see that it expands like a cloud and it covers our cities, our neighbors, our cities, our counties. It keeps moving and as it moves and it covers, it covers the individuals of those areas, the vegetations, animal, everything every sentience. And we keep expanding this like a beautiful long hair of a lady or a cloud that it just keeps covering. Just keep growing and covering. From the county to your states, from the state keeps expanding to the neighboring estates. And as it does, this healing of rejuvenating energy from multiverse is covering each and every sentient, human, plant, or animal, flora or fauna. It's all covered. And we keep expanding. The next state, the next or if you're in a different country, the next country or the next country. Just keep expanding. Now we are covering our own country if you're in the States and if you're out of the States, your neighboring countries and it just we keep growing and growing and covering our neighboring countries and it's slowly covering the continents. Golden light. It includes waters and seas and mountains. Everything is covered. Everything is this beautiful, rejuvenating and healing energy from the multiverse. Keep expanding it and expanding it to cover the joining continent. And the joining continent. And the joining continent. Until everything is covered in golden light, fully and completely. Mother Earth is glowing. We are the source, the center, and we have expanded that through our funnel of beautiful golden light that spread all around us and covered Mother Earth fully and completely. We will continue sending healing energy, rejuvenating energy to any sentience and every sentience, including ourselves, our family, friends, who are all included in this. Continue and keeping our intent and in sending healing energy rejuvenating energy.
any place within your own body that requires attention. And your energy is traveling through that. And it just engulfs that area in beautiful golden light. And silver light that is intertwined. Golden, covered golden light from land to sea, from this earth to its lush jungles. Every sentience, flora, fauna, and us human. Are all receiving this beautiful multiverse energy. And it goes to every every per, every person who's receptive, consciously or unconsciously. And inhaling a rejuvenating energy from the core of Mother Earth that's already covered the core of Mother Earth fully. So we have this energy inside and above and outside and all over of Mother Earth. are sending and sharing this beautiful multiverse healing and rejuvenating energy with our love and gratitude. Feel gratitude and love from your heart. And keep your intent of sending the healing and rejuvenating energy to every sentient.
with God and slowly withdraw this beautiful energy. Slowly alternate to an ex alternate silence until it moves to your country or the neighboring states, moving to your states, land of county, land of city. Where we are. Before setting our intent uh, for the week, anyone who would like to close the chakra or chakra and repeat the instruction, starting with crown chakra, you would try and stop the rotation. Going to third eye, we try and stop the rotation. Throat chakra, we try and stop the rotation. Heart chakra, we try and stop the rotation. Solar plex, we try and stop the rotation. Sacrum, we try and stop the rotation. Basic, we try and stop the rotation. Or you can say, I'm closing my chakras or I'm retracting back all my chakras and closing them now. If you wish to keep them open, it's fine. Just be aware of your energy and other, other individuals or soul energy uh, just surrounding you. And that should be fine. Now we're gonna set our intention for the coming week. For this portion, we're gonna stop the video so it would be our own 